Today we will install, configure, and test fail to ban. For this, you will need access to a terminal on your Raspberry Pi and the internet. I will be doing everything over SSH, but it is easier to unban your IP after testing if you have direct access. Fail to ban can be used for many services. This is a basic example of fail to ban that blocks bad SSH attempts. If you followed my other tutorial and disabled SSH password authentication, you will need to re-enable it in order to test fail to ban. Be sure to disable it again when you are finished. Log in to your Pi. Install fail to ban with sudo apt update sudo apt install tack y fail to ban. cd to slash etsy slash fail to ban. Skim through jail.com for an example of a config file. Note that you should not modify this file. Instead, you should create a jail.conf file or .conf files in the jail.d directory. I personally like to make different files for each service in jail.d, so cd into jail.d. There should be a defaults techdebian.conf file that just enables sshd banning. I like to move this to an sshd specific conf file with sudo move defaults debian.conf sshd.conf. Open it with sudo nano sshd.conf. We will add an ignore IP line to specify IP addresses and domains we never want to block. We can specify multiple IPs and subnets. I will set it to my local subnet. We will also add ban time. This is in seconds. I set it to 10 hours. Finally, we will add max retry. This is the max failed attempts one can make before being banned. I will comment out the ignore IP line for testing and save with control X, Y, enter. Restart fail to ban with sudo systemctl restart fail to ban and confirm it is running with sudo systemctl status fail to ban. Try to log in with a bad password three times noting that you are completely banned after the third attempt. Change your computer's IP, use another computer, or directly connect to the Pi and open a terminal. See how many services have banned IPs with sudo fail to ban tack client status. Here we see sshd so type sudo fail to ban tack client status sshd to learn more. We can see our IP address has been banned. To unban it, run sudo fail to ban tack client set sshd unban ip followed by your IP address and check to make sure it is no longer banned. Thank you for watching and I hope you obtained a bit of knowledge. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe and if applicable watch the next and previous videos in this series. If you like, you can click the link in the description for a text version of this tutorial. Yippee-ki-yay, mother frogger!